Welcome everyone to the wedding of Natalie Acosta and Paul Golia. Growing restless in the way Searching for a brighter day I fell the love of my life and my best friend. Um, I never believed in soulmates until I met you. I love you for the way you make me feel when we're together and I miss you so much when we're apart. We've grown so much together and you enrich my life and inspire me to be better. Thank you for all the perfect days we've had and I can't wait for all the perfect days to come. I love you more than My Natalie. 16 years ago, I moved to California looking for something. Over the course of my time here, I've had different ideas about what that was. But I know now that all along, it was you. It's always been you. I love you more than I ever imagined I was capable of loving anything. Ending each day with you by my side is all the comfort in the world I'll ever need. Natalie, you're the one I've wanted. You're the one I want now. You're the one I want when I'm old. And so today, I promise my love for you is forever. I promise to love you extra on days you need it, and even on the days you don't. I promise to be honest with you even when the truth is hard. And I suspect that if we stay true to each other, and if we always let the love we feel for each other today guide us, I'll keep discovering more and more the exact right words continually over the course of the rest of our lives together. I love you, Natalie, and I'm so excited to call you my wife. An awesome power bestowed upon me by the almighty internet. <laughs> I am overjoyed to legally pronounce you husband and wife.
I couldn't be more happy that she and Paul found each other and have decided to build a life together. I love how much you love Natalie. It's such a beautiful thing to see. So let's raise a toast to Paul and Natalie. The childhood you gave Paul and I, Stacy and Sarah, was one of the most special things. And I, my only hope is that if Paul and Natalie choose to have children, that they have, they have the same experience that we did because it was, it was truly lovely. Doing things for each other, not in the attitude of duty or sacrifice, but in the spirit of joy. It is having the capacity to forgive and forget. It is finding room for the things in the spirit. It's, it's a common search for the good and the beautiful. In closing, it's not only marrying the right person, it's being the right partner. Let's all raise our glasses in a toast to Natalie and Paul. May they enjoy one day their golden wedding anniversary.